Now that we have funds on the Gnosis chain, we need to make sure that we have some XDAI to pay for the transaction fee. If you bridge DAI across to the Gnosis chain, you should already have XDAI in your wallet. If not, we can go to the Gnosis chain resources page at xdai.com and navigate to the faucet section. This will give you details on how to get just a little bit of XDAI to get started. Now that we have some XDAI to pay for transactions, we can navigate to giveth.io and connect our wallet. Once connected, we can navigate to the projects page. Here we can filter projects based on their areas of work. Projects may be listed under several different categories. You may notice that the last category is the giving block. These are projects that were set up through Giveth's partnership with the giving block, which is a custodial crypto donations platform. These projects are only available to donors on Ethereum mainnet. We can also sort projects based on factors like amount raised, age of the project, whether or not the project accepts give, and if the project is verified or not. We can also use the search feature to look up projects by name. If you'd like additional information about a project before you're ready to donate, go ahead and click the Learn More button. This will take you to the project homepage. You can see here that this project is verified. The About page gives you background information on the project. You can also see periodic updates from the project, as well as the total donations and the record of each donation. Once we're satisfied with checking out a project, we can click the Donate button. This will take us to the donation page. For this demo, I'll be donating to the Giveth matching pool. All donations to this pool will eventually be distributed to the verified projects on the platform. While Giveth is open to anyone to create a project, only certain projects are verified. Being verified means the Giveth team has reviewed a project to check that the project is legitimate. For donors, a project being verified means that donations to that project will be eligible for givebacks. For more information on givebacks, check out the video dedicated to this topic. Giveth will accept donations of any ERC20 token. However, only tokens on the drop-down list are eligible for givebacks. If you'd like a token to be added to the drop-down list, please drop a post in the Giveth community forum. To donate a token that's not on the list, paste the contract address into the search bar. Once you've selected the token and the amount you'd like to donate, you can click Donate. If this is your first time using Giveth, you'll be asked to sign in. This signature just connects your wallet and authorizes subsequent transactions. You will then carry out the transaction as you would with any other decentralized protocol. After a couple seconds, your donation will be finalized. By donating through Giveth, 100% of the donation goes directly to the project. In addition, if the donation is to a verified project, the donor may receive up to 70% of the donation back in Give Tokens. Now that we've made a donation, we can check out our account page and profile. Your account is linked to the ETH address of the wallet you connected to Giveth with. This is enough to donate to any project on the platform. However, this is a community-led project and we want you to be part of our community. By filling out your profile with at least your email, you'll be able to receive updates on Giveth development and community events. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and happy giving!